Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I have a general message for you guys. This is going to be a random collective message that somebody out there needs to hear. Whoever needs to hear this will come across this reading. Um, remember that this may not resonate for everyone, okay? So let's get straight into this and find out what Spirit wants you to know. Okay. So I'm getting um, a very strong message here, okay? I'm getting that you could be ignoring a change here, okay? Um, the thing is, is you're not seeing what this change could bring for you, okay? So there could be a change in your life, okay, coming up. Um, you could be ignoring it because there's a little bit of anxiety, Especially if this has to do with money, okay? Um, there's a little bit of anxiety here, okay? Um, so I am getting that this is like a situation where I'm getting it's like business terms as well, okay? So this is like a situation here where like you may like want to make a decision to like upgrade or you may want to make a decision, um, you know, to change your job or to, like, do something different and you're, like, not doing it because you're scared of the outcome, okay? You may not realise this. Um, yeah, you're scared it's not going to show up the way that you expect, okay, or the way that you want. Yeah, so there's like a need to walk away from something here, okay? Um, this does require a lot of change, okay? This could be um, something that's a little bit hard for you to walk away from because there could be something sentimental involved, okay? Like if this, if this is a job, okay, you may have been at this job for like, you know, 10 years or something like that. Um, or like if this is a relationship, you may have been in a relationship for like seven years, if this is a friend. However the energy resonates for you, I do see that, you know, it is a little bit hard for you to walk away from it. For the majority of you, this has to do with like a job, okay, or like something to do with career. I do see that there's a fear that, okay, say that you change your job, that you're not going to make the same amount of money, or say that you want to start your own business, okay, you're scared that you're not going to get, you know, the same amount of return, okay, that you're making now, okay, there is a little bit of fear, anxiety for, you know, your situation, okay, if you do make this change, but the thing is, you're delaying this change, what you don't see what comes like at the future like if you do make this change okay like you have the star energy okay and you have the queen of swords right now they're coming up in reverse because right now you're delaying this um change okay but what i do see is if you do make the change um you're about to stand in your power here okay with the star energy here this is beautiful energy you know, this could be even fame, you know what I mean? Like, you would not be expecting, you know, you're expecting the worst right now, but if you were to make the change, um, it would be everything that you've ever wanted, okay? And it may not be straight away as well. Okay, so this could be something that, and again, this could be a relationship for some of you as well, okay? So if it is a relationship, I do see that you're having a hard time walking away from this person because you really don't know if you can, like... For one, you feel bad for walking away from this person. You also don't know if you could be happy again or find somebody like this person, okay? Um, I do see that this is coming up for a second time, so definitely you've had the chance or opportunity to leave this in the past and you didn't take it. But it didn't lead you anywhere either. You could be dealing with somebody here that, um, I'm hearing sabotaging you, but I'm not really getting that. I'm getting this energy of somebody that's like, 
sort of emotionally manipulating you into staying, okay? Whatever the situation is, they're emotionally manipulating you. It could be a female, it doesn't have to be. But yeah, they're emotionally manipulating you into staying here. But this means keeping you stuck and causing you a lot of stress. You're also being guided to move and make this change, right? At the moment, spirit is guiding you right now. You're getting a lot of downloads. You may be getting a lot of dreams about this situation. Again, um, so this change is coming up, whether you're going to take 555 or just saying, whether you're going to take, you know, the new energy or stay stuck in the old energy, I do see this old energy not changing, okay? Um, now, whether this is a relationship, okay, so if this is a relationship for you, okay, I am getting that you're not happy, Okay, you're obviously not happy here. I can see in the card. You may pretend to be happy, but you're not happy. You've been thinking about walking away from this for a long time, but you've been holding yourself back, okay? You could have kids, or you could have, like, um, you know, a house, assets with this person. But, um, again, this person may try to like emotionally manipulate you into staying with them, right? But it's not gonna change. Like, okay, so they may like pretend they're gonna change, say they're gonna change, okay? Within a few weeks, it's the same, okay? It's keeping you stuck. For some of you, this is a soul tie that's keeping you stuck. It's also taking you away from your energy. There's also lies here, okay? There's things that you do not know here, okay? And if they did come out, um, you probably end this anyway, that's if it's for a relationship. Also, you could be dealing with a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces here, or a Capricorn. If this is, um, a job, okay? If this is a job, right? I am saying that you're giving to, you know, you're not really getting recognized, okay? Um, yeah, your efforts aren't getting recognized. You may have been delaying this, okay, because you feel like you rely on this money. I am getting it could be a relationship to be honest. I'm not, re I'm not really getting it for a job. I'm getting it more like a relationship or it could be like a friendship. Hmm. I am getting that like this real innocent vibe from you, okay? Like, you know, you're really loving, you're really innocent. But. This other person, not so much, okay? They're manipulative, they're a little bit dark, a little bit selfish here. Uh, I'm hearing walking on eggshells. You may feel like you have to walk on eggshells around this person, or you have to like watch what you say. You may even have to hide things from this person because of their reaction. Um, I'm getting that you've been staying with this person, but it's like ignoring your intuition and you know it, okay? Um, with the death with the death and the world in reverse, okay? This is definitely like a delay of an ending. Um, this is not going anywhere, okay? It's like you're trying to redirect this, but it's not going anywhere. And you know this, like intuitively you know this. I'm getting that there could be a secret here. Okay, there could be a secret here that you don't know, but spirits, okay, has been telling you, like, you intuitively know this, but this person has been emotionally manipulating you into thinking that you're crazy or something like that, or that you're wrong, okay, and I'm getting that some of you may not have, like, any 
solid evidence but you could like be having dreams okay or something like that spirits like letting you know what's going on and that how this person is hiding something from you like you know but again you tell you like you confront them and they completely deny it they, they make out you're crazy okay i just think 10 10 this person thinks they can control you okay this person is emotionally manipulating you okay because they want to control you and it's like they feel like they know how you tick how you work wow i don't know who you're dealing with but look this person does a lot of sneaky shit behind your back there's a lot of lies here okay and the thing is about this person is like i'm getting that hmm, for some of you you may have like okay if you're in a relationship with this person and there was any cheating in the past or like any like you know talking to other people any red flag okay um they talk their way out of it and now they keep now they keep doing shit because they think they can talk their way out of it okay they think they've got you worked out they think they can man manipulate you into not believing what other people say, okay, with your intuition. Hmm. I don't like this energy. I, I don't know, I don't like this energy, okay, with the page of wands and the seven of swords. I don't like this energy, right? Again, it's a person that literally does what the fuck they want. And then if you suspect a thing here, they will make out your crazy, they will emotionally manipulate you, they will do what they can to make you think that it's not real, okay, um, and because they got away with it once, they think they could continuously get away with it. There's something here that if it comes out, I'm getting they could be juggling, but if it comes out and it's going to come out, okay, spirit's already been like letting you know about this, but if it comes out, um, that's it, you're ending this and they know it, okay? Look for some of them, I do see with this energy, right? They could literally. They could literally, okay, um, be hiding something that could end this, right? And I am getting it could be a person, they could be juggling. You would end this straight away. And they know this. You could be dealing with a Taurus here or a Pisces or an Aquarius. They're freaking out because they did something here, okay? They weren't thinking about the future and they know if you find out, you'll end it, right? It's like their biggest fear is you finding out this sneaky ass shit. But I am getting that they continuously do sneaky shit and then lie about it, right? Oh. I don't know, you could be dealing with somebody that literally lied their way out of everything, but the thing is, like, they lie, they manipulate, they also can get violent, okay? Like, you have to, like, walk on eggshells around this person, they can get violent, okay? Especially if you're not believing them, okay, or not agreeing with them. I'm hearing the name Daniel. Straight up, whoever you're dealing with here is selfish, okay? They're selfish, they're keeping shit from you, they're keeping secrets from you, they could be keeping another, like a whole other person from you. Um, they're very manipulative, okay? I'm hearing cold, calculated. This person, they pretend they're in love with you. Like, I'm not saying they don't have any love for you. But they do a lot of mind games. Like, you know, they could pretend they're in love with you, but 
they are really selfish. They're hiding. It's like if you're not agreeing with them, if you go against them, they could get violent too, right? Like you may be scared to go against this person. Yeah, so there is this choice. Okay? Um, there's this energy coming up, like, you know, are you going to stay? Are you going to go? Um, some of you continue to stay because you're scared of either being alone or hurting this person or just scared of this person in general. I'm getting something about these sunglasses, like I'm picturing these sunglasses. But, like, I literally, these sunglasses that I'm picturing is my, are my friends, and we call them the ego glasses. That could literally resonate for you. Like, this person could put on, like, something like a pair of glasses or, like, you know, a, a piece of clothing, whether it's, like, designer or whatever, and their ego comes out. Like, let me know if that resonates, okay? You're dealing with a really selfish person, okay? Not gonna lie, you're dealing with a really selfish person, okay? Somebody that's very emotionally manipulative, okay? They hold a lot of secrets. Um, basically, they get mad if you don't believe them, and they literally will... I'm getting this person will, like, have all stories. So, for one, if you suspect them cheating, they'll call you crazy, okay? Um, but then they also will, like, change their stories up, okay? And it's like... You know, I'm getting that energy as well. Like, you could be dealing with a Gemini here. I am getting that spirit, okay? It's sending you a lot of messages about this connection right now. Um, and I'm getting that you're sort of looking at them, okay? And they can sort of see, whoever you're dealing with here, they can see that you're looking at, like, these dreams you're having, however spirit's communicating with you, it's like you're looking at these signs and they're getting a little bit nervous here, right? Because they realise that there's things that can come up here that literally would ruin everything that you would like leave them over, right? Like there would be no coming back. And I am getting that this person, right? I'm getting 444. Okay, let me know if that resonates. This person... If you do not believe their bullshit story, again, they get really angry, upset. You may start to, like, you know, they might they might get violent here, right, as well, I'm saying. I'm getting that they could also, like, um, yeah, again, be like, oh, you know, I love you. But then if you still don't believe them, they get violent or something. Like, you feel stuff. You feel like the thing is, like, that they, they control you as well. Like, this person is a very controlling person here. Right, really controlling person, okay? You could be dealing with um, somebody that's very possessive. Um, yet, I'm getting this person, like, they will do whatever they want, but, like, they will basically control your every move, if that makes sense. Yeah, like, you cannot make your own choices, okay? Um, and you feel that, like, you're restricted, right? Like, you cannot be your own person, right? Again, this is not going anywhere, okay? This person keeping you stuck, you cannot be your own person, okay? They are very emotionally manipulative. Um, they may say they're really loyal, okay? There's a lot of secrets here. A lot of secrets that could end this marriage I'm hearing. So if you guys are married, well, I just named 9-11 and I said that too. There definitely um, could be something from the past coming up here which makes you walk away from this person. Again, you're going to be dealing with them trying their hardest to manipulate you out of thinking they did this, right? You could be uh, dealing with a Taurus. It could end...
with the Seven of Swords upright, the Hierophant in, rever in reverse, and the um, Ace of Wands in reverse, because this could have been like um, them giving into some type of like sexual temptation in the past, okay? Um, and that coming to light, okay? Them trying to hide it, but that coming to light, and this ends this relationship. Again, they're going to pretend they didn't do it. But I am getting that. I'm getting that um, they're going to get real nervous, okay? If you speak about this, they, you're going to get some type of evidence that they can't deny, okay? And this is going to make them, this person's going to be begging for you back. For some of you, you may be really scared to leave this because, like, um, you don't want to, like, break up a happy home, I'm hearing, okay? Especially if you're married to this person. But the only thing is, is if you're staying, you're breaking your own heart and keeping yourself stuck. They're going to try to manipulate their way out of this, okay? They're going to try to lie on you. They're going to try to, they're going to try everything, okay? Um, but I am saying that there is no coming back from this, okay? Like, this does it. This does it for you. And I'm getting that you've stayed, okay? You know... For a long time, you know, putting up with this person's shit because you're scared of, like, breaking up a happy home here. Um, but it's, like, coming to the point whether you're going to stay and keep yourself unhappy or leave and, you know, start again. Um, leave this behind you, right? Some of you may feel a little insecure, a little weak here, okay? But there is this truth that they've been hiding. be a third party okay again you've spoken to this okay or your intuition talking to like talking to you right now the thing is is you've had dreams about this or whatever um well yeah this is the secret that they're hiding at all cost right listen to your intuition right now oh and this secret coming to light guys okay um again your intuition talking to you could be dealing with a cancer here You're going to see this person, when you find this out, you're going to see this person in a whole different light, okay? This person, they pretend they're really loyal, they pretend that they would never hurt you, okay? They pretend they love you so much, okay? What you find out is going to make you look at them in a whole different way. I am getting that you're walking away from this person, you're taking your power back. Okay, they're gonna try to manipulate you, they're gonna try to lie, okay, they're gonna try everything, call you crazy, whatever. Okay, call if for example if somebody else tells you this information, they're gonna be like, Oh no, they just wanna break us up or whatever, okay. No, you're taking your power back, you're moving away from this person, you're not taking their bullshit excuses no more. You're taking your power back, okay, and I'm getting you moving on. Yeah, I'm getting you you're gonna find out about a third party. I am getting for some of you, they have like two other th like two other people or there's been two other people and I am hearing like they could have got somebody else pregnant. You're gonna find all this out though, okay? And also your intuition's been telling you, but you've been ignoring it because they've been manipulating you into thinking you're crazy, right? Yeah, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work for them anymore. Okay? They're lying, okay, they're manipulating you. It's like whatever they've done coming up. And they're not going to be able to lie their way out of this one, okay? Um, and again, this could end the relationship. But I am getting that spirit want you to end this relationship because it's not going anywhere. It's keeping you stuck, okay? It's wanted to end for a long time. I'm hearing it's a karmic situation, okay? So, yeah, that's all I have for you guys. I really hope this resonated. If it did, please let me know in the comments. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.